development consists of two important parts and each one of them requires different skills and knowledge of technologies. Front-end developer deals with what the user interacts with and back-end is all that goes behind the scenes. Now according to Tech Republic, web development is one of the 10 hottest tech skills in 2019. Hi everyone, this is Shantini from Edureka and in today's session, we will discuss the front-end developer salary based on different factors. Now before we begin the session, let's have a look at today's agenda. So first we will get an idea about who is a front-end developer and then we will move on and have a look at the different job trends for a front-end developer and then the different salary trends as well. Next up we will see the company based salary and then we will have a look at the popular skills for front-end developer and finally the salary based on your experience. Now before we begin the session, don't forget to subscribe to Edureka's YouTube channel to stay connected. Now who is a front-end developer? So a front-end developer is someone who implements the web designs through programming languages like HTML, CSS and JavaScript. Now the front-end developers work with the design and outlook of the website. Whereas the back-end developers program what goes on behind the scenes like databases. So if you head to any website, you can see the work of a front-end developer in the navigation, layouts and also the way a site looks different from your phone. So basically web design is all about the way a website looks while front-end development is how the design actually gets implemented on the website. Now the front-end developer is the person who is responsible for this implementation. So now that you know about who is a front-end developer, let's move on and have a look at the different job trends. Now here you can see a number of jobs in different locations in the US. Now this data has been collected from indeed.com so you can see that how the number of jobs vary based on the locations. For example, in New York you have around 1046 jobs for a front-end developer whereas in Seattle you have 698, San Francisco has 659, Chicago has 532 and finally Washington has 478 job roles opened for a front-end developer. Now the recent stats from the US Bureau of Labor Statistics forecasts that by 2026 the number of web development positions will grow by 15 percent as compared to the numbers from 2016. Now that's a great number. Now talking about some of the key roles of a front-end developer, you have the front-end engineer, junior front-end developer, front-end software engineer and the front-end developers. Now let's move on and have a look at the different salary trends of a front-end developer. Now the average salary for a front-end developer is around 4,94,000 in India. Whereas in the USA, a senior front-end developer earns around $100,000 on an average. And for a junior front-end developer, the average income is around $70,000. Now these front-end web developers have one of the most bankable skill sets on the job market today. Now according to Glassdoor, the national median income for front-end developers tops more than $70,000. In markets where the competition for top tech talent is fierce, the median salary can rise above $100,000. Now these were some of the basic data for a front-end developer salary. Now let's get into the details and have a look at the front-end developer salary by state. So here is a list of front-end developer salaries for different US states with tech hubs or a high ratio of web development job openings. So for example, in California, the average salary is around $119,000, whereas in New York, it's around $114,000, and in Washington, we have $107,000. And in Massachusetts, you have around $107,000 again, and in Georgia, it goes down to $91,000, and in Colorado, you have $89,000. So these are some of the average salary based on the different US states. Now moving on to the average earning of front-end developers for different states in India. In Gurgaon, the average salary is around 6 lakhs, whereas in Mumbai, it goes down to 5,86,000. And in Bangalore, you get around 5,19,000 as your average salary. Whereas in Hyderabad you have around 5 lakh and in Pune around 4 lakh 81,000 and in Chennai you have around 4 lakh 71,000 as your average salary. Now these were the different ranges of salary based on the state. 
Now let's move on and have a look at the company based salary of a front end developer. There is a huge growth in the employment percentage of front end developers for multinational companies. So let's have a look at the list of top companies and their average salary for the role of a front end developer. One of the greatest MNCs TCS has around 590,000 as the average salary whereas Accenture provides around 6 lakhs as your average salary. Talking about fresh deck we have 6 lakhs 95,000 for HCL we have 6 lakhs 75,000 and companies like Capgemini provides around 6 lakhs 79,000 as well. Next up there's Cognizant that has an average salary of 5 lakhs 79,000 and finally we have Infosys which goes down to 3 lakh 95,000. Now this data has been collected from Payscale and it just gives you a list of different multinational companies and the average salary that they provide for the role of a front end developer. Now your salary does not only depend on the geography or the company. It also depends on the set of skills that you possess. Now the skills in JavaScript, AngularJS and jQuery are correlated to pay above average. Whereas skills like CSS and HTML pay less than the market rate. So let's have a look at the different average salaries based on the skills that you possess. So if you are well versed with JavaScript your average salary would be around 5,13,000 and if you are well versed with CSS it would be around 4,87,000. Whereas if your skill with angular JS it comes up to 5 lakh 12 thousand for jQuery it's around 4 lakh 97 thousand and for bootstrap it's around 4 lakh 94 thousand. So you can see that JavaScript and angular JS are on the higher side when it comes to skills and salary and JavaScript is definitely topping the table in popularity as well. Now these were the different salary trends based on the company skills etc. Now let's move on and see how your experience matters when it comes to the salary. So there are different levels of experience. First you have the entry level front end developer which means that you have experience less than one year. For that your average salary would be around 3 lakhs per annum. The next level is the early career front end developer. That is you have experience of around one to four years. And for this range your average salary would be around 4,27,000 per annum. Next level is the mid career front end developer which means you have an experience of about 5 to 9 years. And for this your average salary would be around 8 lakhs per annum. And the final level is the experienced front end developer where you must have experience around 10 to 19 years. And for this level your average salary can go up to 13 lakhs per annum. Now if you are someone looking to get into an interesting career now would be the right time to upskill and take advantage of the front end development career opportunities that come your way. So this was all about today's session. I hope you got an idea about the different salary ranges in India and US based on your skills experience and also the company you are working for. Now don't forget to share your opinion in the comment section below till then thank you and happy learning. I hope you have enjoyed listening to this video. Please be kind enough to like it and you can comment any of your doubts and queries and we will reply them at the earliest. Do look out for more videos in our playlist and subscribe to Edureka channel to learn more. Happy learning.